Oh, what is up guys, just welcome back to another video. Yesterday I went to a hockey game, click the links in the description box if you want to see that. That vlog was pretty fun. Right now it is currently uh, drizzling and it is 50 degrees. It ain't raining too bad, but there is a little uh, drizzle coming down right now, which is a good thing because it's starting to feel a little bit like winter time and I definitely love winter time. Let me know in the comment section below, are you a winter time kind of guy? Me? Hell yeah, baby, I'm a winter time kind of guy. I just got to back in, go eat and head off to work. But, um, yeah, guys, I'm just, I'm, just, I'm just happy that it is getting cold weather because for the longest time, it's just been hot and humid. I have a question for you guys. If you went out on a date with somebody and you invited them to go out to a restaurant and, and they accepted to go to the restaurant and you told them to go to, but in reality, they don't like the food or they're just a straight up vegan and they're like, well, I'll pick at this little piece of chicken or this little piece of uh, salad but they really didn't want it so they're not going to tell you I don't want to eat this food because they're going to think you're going to be disappointed in the long run so they're not going to tell you I don't want to eat this food because I was talking to somebody at work and she was basically saying if you're going to go out with somebody and let's say they want to go to Taco Bell but you don't eat fast food she said you should man up and just tell them I don't eat this kind of food but you can stop at Taco Bell and I can stop at Subway and get something and we can both enjoy our meal when we get back to the house. She said she had somebody go out of their way to sit there and pick at the food, like just nibble on it and pick at the piece of chicken. And, and she was like, Dude, are you hungry? And they're like, no, not really. But they really didn't want to tell her I was a vegan or I was a vegetarian. Is that stupid or should you just be straight up with somebody? That would piss me off in the long run. You know that gas is 2.28? Yeah, so it was weird. I went to the other gas station. I guess it was closed, and I tried to get gas, and literally it only allowed me to pump like 62 cents. I guess when the gas station actually is closed, like the actual store and everything, uh, it was a Murphy's USA gas station. I only got 60 cents out of it, and it was uh, and it cut off. So I guess when that is closed, it actually closes the pumps off. That was weird. $2.28 instead of the two twenty five that I tried at the Murphy's gas station. It was weird. It would not even pump my gas, but I never experienced any gas station that was actually closed and they had the lights off. I was like, oh, okay, I'll just try to get gas anyway. I just thought the pumps were on 24 hours a day, but apparently once the uh, stores close down and the lights are off, that store closes and the gas pumps are shut off. But only $0.60, cents, that was kind of uh, weird. And it is currently like 35 degrees out here literally like 35 degrees and it feels actually pretty nice because usually we get hot humid weather but that's my little video facebook and i will talk to you guys there i just thought it was so weird going to that other gas station that was pretty much dead like there was no lights on here so i'm never going to that gas station <laughs> late at night Yeah, luckily I have these guys, because if I didn't, I wouldn't be driving anywhere or going anywhere. Somewhere between last night and today, I lost my car keys and I can't find them, which uh, totally sucks. The only reason I'm freaking out about that is, guys, because here's what I have for my stupid car key. It's this stupid mother trucker right here, but 
The other one has my gym membership on it, so I can go to the gym. It has keys in my backyard. Um, it's weird because I walked in my house, and I was getting groceries last night, so I knew for a fact that uh, I had to have my car keys in the house. And you know when you misplace them, or you set them aside somewhere where you normally don't set them, they get misplaced and you look at here's the funny thing is you look around that house like 30 40 50 60 80 90 times and you won't look in one single spot or you look in the same spot but you just don't notice them so hopefully i find them because i got work in the morning uh or tomorrow so hopefully i can find them and i don't want to lug this stupid bad boy around like literally doesn't that look like some stabbing weapon it's to reset the uh sprinklers when the sprinklers need to be reset you hit the little button and it goes in there but it looks like i could be stabbing somebody <laughs> <laughs> what's up guys we're back i finally found my keys that i was talking about see it had like the gym membership thing it had my pops uh dry uh key to his um nissan rogue it had my car keys and it has another a lot of other car keys it's called janitor car keys haha <laughs> Not really. The reason is I how I found him is my pops was getting into his vehicle, right? He was getting ready to leave to go to work. And I'm like, yo, dad, that's my car keys. He's like, no, nah, that's mine. And I looked at him like, look at it. And he goes, oh, damn. So basically, he grabbed both sets of car keys, my car keys and his car keys, and proceeded to leave. And he didn't realize that he grabbed both car keys. That's why I was freaking out so much trying to find these car keys and in reality he had them the whole time and i was like i looked everywhere i'm like i'm like i know for a fact when i brought the groceries into the house they were on the table they were right there near the table in that area where i normally put my keys when i come home so this time it wasn't trevor's fault that he lost his keys it was somebody else uh, took them and left so uh as always guys it is true though you still freak out because you don't know if they, if, you, if they fell out outside if someone stole them you have no clue but i'm glad that i still have my car keys man i'm, I'm definitely glad that i got my car keys that i can go to work now i can uh, go to the jimmy gym but as always remember to hit that like button subscribe button i'm going that way you guys go in the comment section below and hit that subscribe button. You hit that like button. You let me know, would you have freaked out if you lost your car keys? And what would you have done? So like I said, I'm going that way. You guys go this way. And I'm out. Woo!